Horizon Hobby is hooking us up with a big flying wing to play with and we're picking it up from Graves Hobby Shop in Orlando, Florida. I'm so excited because I don't, I don't get to go into hobby shops anymore and they're so fun. This is not going to be easy to fit. I'm Josh and this is Josh. Welcome to Hi. Play Test. Oh wait, it's the wrong show. This is the Horizon Hobby Optera. They have been wanting us to try out some fixed wing stuff for a while, so they sent us this to play with. I mean, they just went right for it. That's I a big wing. This it's, is huge. It's, it's bigger than me. It's definitely. Look, you can't even see me. Where did I go? What? Hey. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> this wing is made to be an FPV wing, but we've done something a little bit different and we've actually fitted on the DJI digital FPV system. Hopefully she's nice and stable, because wings are a little harder to fly than quads. This yeah. does have the AS3X receiver flight controller Okay, so it's situation. got stabilization. So it has some stabilization right. built in. It's not gonna be quite the same level as one of our FPV drones. So when we fly one of our FPV quadcopters on beta flight, I mean, the responsiveness and the stability that they provide, I mean, it's it's just unmatched. And you're yeah. not, so even though this does have uh, a gyro in it and is going to provide some stability, it's, it's still not going to be the same because whereas a quad operates with differential thrusts yeah. and is able to just apply thrust to whatever corner, this actually just has control surfaces. So if you're really not familiar with planes, these control surfaces move and the air moving over the wing hits the control surface and that's able to change the angle of your wing. But I mean, it's foam, it's flimsy, the air has to pass over so it's not gonna be as responsive. Yeah. It's not gonna be as instantaneous as spinning up a motor. So as we've been using this DJI system, one of the more common questions is how do you wire the thing up? Because there's like six or seven wires that come off of it. It can seem a little daunting where all these wires are gonna go, especially in something like a wing. But the beautiful part is our setup, we only have two wires. You got ground and power. You only need to power it because to send the video to you, that's all you need. Everything else is gonna be for more telemetry information to know what your battery is, and if you're gonna use the control link, but we're not using the control link. We're right. gonna use the spectrum radio, and we don't, we're not too worried about getting the telemetry information. So all you gotta do is power the thing up and it's gonna send beautiful HD video back down to the ground. I went over to Sean's place and he helped us put this together because he's our, he's our resident plane guy. I like drones. I like rigid pieces of carbon fiber and screws and things that thread together. Planes go together with like, it's like foam, tape. Sean, Sean, thank you for your help. You really made me feel a lot better having Anytime, someone know what they're doing. Who's gonna fly this thing first, man? I'll fly it. You, you're out confident? Wait, have you flown a wing FPV before? No. Oh, you've never done an FPV no. wing before? So we're gonna double check the balance here. It should be good, but that is kind of a pain with wings that we don't think about too much with drones. It's a little nose heavy, but. Do you, you wanna leave it nose heavy? But this is probably excessive. Too much? Okay, so we'll just scoot yeah. the back. This is easy to fix. This wing, you kinda wanna keep up a little bit of speed. Okay. If you slow down too much with it, I've actually had it tip stall and do a spiral of death into the ground. Oh gosh, so, yeah. I don't want that to happen. So actually, before we take off, there's a couple settings I wanna make sure we set in the goggles. There's a function of the system called low power mode, and when your drone is disarmed, the system can sense that, and it reduces the power of the air unit to keep it from overheating. And, you know, depending on how long you might be powered on and idling somewhere, that can be a good feature, but we don't have a flight controller in here, so it's not gonna know whether we're flying or not. Now, it's, it should be smart enough to know that it's not hooked up at all and just not use that low power mode, but if you're doing something like this, I recommend going in and turning off that feature altogether just so that you can be safe. I'd give it three quarters throttle, probably. Oh boy, oh boy, how's she flying? Uh, it feels like it's gonna nosedive, but like, okay, I'm going to be. All right, I feel a little scared to turn. Okay, that's not bad. Just do a low pass. Why don't you do like a turn around one of the light poles? Holy crap. Oh, low pass. That oh, that low pass. Oh, that low pass. Oh, I'm sick. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's see if I can land. You can do it though. Oh, maybe not. Nope. Oh, God. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> 
Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! He was like, he was right there against the tree. Am I like coming in way too fast to land? Yeah, you should I fast. You need to start you farther from the trees. Go way past. Well, the, the tricky tree. thing is there's trees, so, yeah, so I have to be at elevation no matter how far away I go. Well, I would say just be like skimming the trees. So like go out further and be like, you know, cut them off. That was fun. I'm used to a quad, so I was trying to get it up to the speed of a quad. So I was like full throttle the whole time. And I just want to go fast. Dri Ricky Bobby. Dream's a little slower, so I might I might get a longer flight time out of yeah. this. Are you gonna fly next? I want. I, you yeah, know what? Fly. I want to fly. Alright, we should be in launch mode. Oh wow! Nice it's so beautiful. Yeah. Yeah, the colors look really good today. It's good, good lighting. <sighs> this is just relaxing. Dude, I am screwing up. I keep trying to yaw. There's no <laughs> yeah, yaw. There's no yaw. There's no yaw. I'm like... So the turns are a little scary. I just get a little height. My left stick was like fully... I'm like, why aren't I... But look at this. I have throttle all the way down and off the stick. And I'm just, I'm just hanging out, man. I'm pretty much just hanging out. I feel like I could almost make it. Oh, it's starting to get... Oh, okay. I'm starting to feel the stall. Wow, you went a long time with no throttle. No throttle, man. Oh, the, oh, but you know what's weird about when you turn? It really wants to like stall on you. Because you end up, you shave off so much of your speed. Yeah. Oh, that river's so pretty. Yeah. The trick isn't to do flips and stuff. The trick is just to not stall, keep it in the air, and then just like enjoy the ride, man. Yeah. Right, I'm no throttle, I'm shooting. Ooh. Yeah, that looks good. That looks good. You think Maybe it's good? Give a little pitch down, little pitch down. Not much. But don't, yep, that's perfect. Just keep her going. Keep her going. Keep her going. Keep her going. Just down a little bit. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You're good. You're good. Nice. <laughs> I had to jump the gap. That is too fun. Too fun, man. I thought you didn't like wings. Well, I hate everything that comes with wings. <laughs> Screwing with foam and glue and CG mattering so much, but like once you're up in the air, you're stunting with it. I don't know if I've gotten to chase an FPV wing that's being piloted FPV. I think anytime oh, I chase yeah? wings, they're usually always being flown line of sight. So, so the patterns are different, right? Line of sight pilots is just, just like circuits. But you're FPV, so we'll be able to like line up things Yeah, it should better. be better, yeah. Yeah, and you like maybe, like we could even fly between some of the light poles or stuff like that, you know? You're on channel three, I'm on channel six. There should be plenty of separation. I'm ready when you are. Right. Ooh, my video is terrible. Is it? Yeah. Oh, we're standing so close to each other. Hold yeah, on. Can you move? Hold on. I'm Please. just, I'm just, someone tell me if I'm about to hit something. You're, you're, yeah, it's much better. Okay. Thank you, Sean. So that is something that we have to keep in mind with the DJI system. You got system. me? No, I backed okay. off, so I'm over the soccer oh. field. Is your video better now? I'm right over the soccer field. Yeah, it's much better. Okay. Right above the guy right Higher. now. Higher. There you are. on the power loop. <laughs> 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 oh, I don't want to land. Landing is the responsible thing to do, but oh, I don't rolls are pretty fun. Mm, beautiful. A little far away, but. <laughs> <laughs> so I just practiced landing on the plane while it was parked. What do you think about landing on it in the air? You could probably land and then fall off of it and take keep going. No, I want to see if I can get it parked and just ride that thing. So. I mean, I'll I'll disarm before I come down, but even the only thing I'm worried about is that it's so round that it might just like roll off, but we have to try it. I mean, at some point, maybe get a couple more flights first. You want to get a chase in? Yeah, yeah.
the way. No, no quad skids on the plane? No. Yeah. Oh, that was not good. <laughs> I just told you. No quad skids on the bottom of the plane. <laughs> oh my gosh. I told you I did this the first time I flew mine too. Ripped the motor mount right off. Uh, the prop's a little messed up too. Oh no, where? Yeah. How all, bad is it? It's all chewed up. On a wing, it's probably pretty bad. Really? Yeah. I would fly gotta, with this on a drone. Yeah, we got to change that. What? What's it going to do? It's going to vibrate a lot. It's going to vibrate a lot. And? And it's foam. footage. And it's got hyper smooth. <laughs> we gotta try it. You killed my filter! Uh, it was an accident. Everything was going so smooth, and then I thought I would just copy your move, which is fly over the parking lot too low until it hits the ground. <laughs> we both kind of made the same mistake there. Well, but the difference is this quad, I mean, we've got tons of props, we'll put yeah. on props, and it's good to go. The plane, I ripped the entire motor off. The whole motor's just off. <laughs> well, I saw that and I was like, so the entire plane is just destroyed. And Sean's like, no, you just glue it back. I just, that's so yeah, wild. One of the main reasons that we wanted to make this episode was to kind of reach out to the plane guys. And, you know, do you think they're gonna make fun of us because we just got a store-bought plane rather than built our own? There's nothing wrong with buying a store-bought plane, but if you really want to get the full experience, you gotta build one for yourself because it's a lot of fun. I like building the plane just almost as much as I like flying the plane. So Sean put something together for us that's scratch built. We got to experience a real polished, store-bought experience. I mean, I, I love how polished the kit is. Comes with stickers and it clicks together. So when you put yours together, what you do? You just cut some foam and... So after building about 100 flight test planes by hand, I bought a 5,000 hour laser so I could cut them out quickly. So I actually laser cut the plans flight test gave me for free. Um, I modified it a little bit, but then I used hot glue and just a little bit of time. So and find some... paper and glue. Paper and glue. And that's a machine. So this is a modified flight test arrow. I widened the center of it so I could fit more stuff in it. And I've got the DJI air unit mounted in there. That is the actual air unit itself. And does that have y'all since it has two no. props? This, I, I, I made this plane a long time ago and I tried to use differential thrust with it, but they're so close together that the yaw doesn't really do much. Well also, doesn't a plane, when the motor accelerates, tend to want to twist? So do you yeah. have them going in the opposite directions so they, they counteract each other? Absolutely, they're, they're counter-rotating on purpose to counteract the torque roll that a plane or a wing usually gets. So this one won't torque roll at all. So usually when you have a wing like this, in order to get HD footage you have to have some kind of Mobius or uh, run cam on top of it, but with the DJ Air Unit it's awesome because I can literally record 1080p and not carry any extra weight and it's streamlined still, so that's awesome. So did you put an SD card in the Air Unit? No. We should put an SD card. this oh boy. <gasps> oh boy oh boy oh, oh boy. boy oh, oh no. no where was that <laughs> far far away oh my gosh looks like you got to take a walk of shade yeah you got the one wheel though <laughs> Hey 
If there's anyone that could land on a plane, I think your boy's up to the challenge. Just a little concerned because it's rounded. I think just make sure to disarm. Yeah. So just get past the winglets and then just kind of plop down on it. I think the little uh, nicks in the prop really help balance it out. All right, where are you at? Oh, I see you. All right, you got me? All right, I'm gonna turn around and come down the field. All right, I have chopped throttle, I'm going nice and slow. Mount the plane whenever you're ready. Are you, are you on me? I was for a oh second. Oh my gosh, no, first try, are you kidding me? I flipped and rearmed. <laughs> it's on. I didn't quite stay on you, I was a little too far back. Oh, oh, you were good. Yeah, no, I nice. Oh, you're down. You're spiraling down. Oh, what just happened? You must have got into a... Why did it stall? I just, like, couldn't get out of it at all. Yep, you have to drop throttle and uh, just glide for a second. Drop throttle? Yeah. Drop that's throttle. so counterintuitive. I, I just kept adding throttle, trying to get out of it. Yeah, that's what I did, too, and that's why I landed in the water. Honestly, we might be okay. Dude, I think we might be able to just tape this back on and throw her back up. I was too fixated on the stunt with Jeff that I just fell back to my old habits and I went for a sharp turn and like so essentially brought it to a hover and these don't hover. Are we gonna be able to try again? Oh, we're trying it oh, again. Nice. We're going right back up. Just get it going across the field as slow as possible. Okay, we're you're gonna, gonna try to land, land on you. Okay. All right, here you go. Yeah. All right, I can see you and Jeff. Let's see it, Jeff, make it happen. It's all you. You got it, Jeff. Oh my gosh, no way! I'm so glad Sean piloting this. Did it just tip you up? Oh yeah, I just did a flippy flop. I felt like I was flying a quad again. <laughs> I'm going for it, here we go. Uh-oh, coming up on the trees. You're getting close to the trees no. now. All right, I'm bailing. I'm just scared, I can't believe you've done it so many times, Jeff. <laughs> All right, I'm trying it. Where are you? Oh boy, here we go. I can't rearm. Oh, oh, I'm down. <laughs> Jeff is definitely the superior oh. at plane perching. <laughs> That's when awesome. you touch down, I came off. <laughs> yeah! That's awesome. Uh, I'm sorry, I wrecked the plane. Oh, again. the prop's broken too. We're done. Is there. it really? Yeah. Oh, that's the end of it, huh? That's the end I was looking for. This was so fun because it was like reliving like all the cool stuff you see, like jet planes refueling yeah. and like Avengers landing on their helicarrier. I was like, I'm Iron Man right now. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm just up front getting hit every now and then <laughs> doing this. <laughs> but neither of us would have been able to. <laughs> to fly the plane. Oh, yeah. you Once saw that happened to me already. No, because you saw I just oh, I yeah. tried to turn around and just went down. So you're the only one that could have done this, like seriously. It was fun. I enjoyed it. So big thanks to DJI for sponsoring this episode and making these episodes possible. Thank you guys for making these episodes possible. Uh, your support by shopping at rotorat.com helps us keep doing things like this, trying new things, experimenting. What else would you like us to see us fly? What else would you like? <clears throat> what else would you like to see us fly? We love trying out different RC things and giving it the old uh, FPV drone twist. Also, don't forget, huge shout out to Horizon Hobby for making this possible, and Graves RC for kind of facilitating where we actually went and picked up the plane. So, yeah. if you're local to Orlando area, definitely check out Graves RC if you're into 
anything RC. They got cars, planes, boats, all drones. Oh, I, all the have RCs. you been there before? Yeah. Oh, it's huge. Yeah, they There's got so everything. much stuff. Make sure to hit that like button or the dislike button. Oh, up sorry. is better, but down's fine. You know, take take a piece of hot glue and just smack that up <laughs> like button. <laughs>